Another day, another dollar. Back at it again. Gonna attack E30. Okay. Chinese on deck, um, ZF320 picked up from my boy, Stoneface Killer. I'm waiting to pick him up. What's up, dog? I said it. Yeah, hey, I just want to say thank you for the tranny. Of course, no worries. Uh, I think the video, hey, what's up? <laughs> yeah. So, we, we got another piece to the puzzle, and uh, shout out to Stone. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to get back to beating my meat. I'll see you. Uh, see you then. All right, bye. <laughs> yeah, keep it right there for now. Go ahead and clean it up, but it's going to be mated to that S52. So, S52 with a ZF320. Your boy about to be smacking gears like this. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to re up. You got the drugs or what? Huh? You got the drugs? The who? The drugs. The drugs. Shout out to my mom, she got the drugs. I'm gonna go ahead and get back to scrubbing this damn motor. Cause the motor is just as dirty as the engine bay, so I'm gonna get to that. Enjoy some some elbow grease scrubbing. <laughs> Look at this. Gosh, it's so bright here. Oh my gosh. I hope that's fine. It's so bright here. But it's like super dark over here. It's 527 and it's this dark out here. Ugh. Ta daylight saving sucks. Or is it nighttime savings? I don't know. Alright, I'm going back on this. 637. Took me about like an hour and 30 minutes to realize that. For one more light, just push the engine over there to the light. Um, yeah, don't do drugs, kids. Oh, and that's about it. Um, I'm tired of cleaning, man. I'm tired of cleaning. Look at these. My hands hurt. Um, I'm still gonna do way more cleaning, though. All this needs more cleaning, and this bad boy needs more cleaning. But for the most part, um, I don't want to go all tweakered out and get everything, but I do want to make this look really nice so I can see where leaks come from. 
Yeah, word to the wise. Have engine out, clean it. You have a dirty part, clean it. Just makes it easier to diagnose something or to find a leak or just to see all the beautifulness, you know what I mean? All right, let's see how easy it is when you have a freaking pressure washer. I forgot to freaking scrub it first, but let's just see how it works. Okay. Yeah, for sure, that works wonders. I don't even have to scrub that much. I should have did that to the whole engine bay. Daytime update type shit. As you can see, it still needs a little bit of scrubbing. I'll get to that. Check it out over here. Daylights. I'm gonna tidy those wires up too. It's gonna look sick. Bye, Prius. All right, let's get back to it. Another day, another E30 fix. I always wanted to shave an Ninja Bay. I mean, it's not professional, but it is what it is, you know what I mean? Um, I still have to go in here and plug these up with my welder. I'm not gonna go ahead and do too much with the Ninja Bay, but I just wanted to shave it and make it look pretty. Uh, I don't know if I'm gonna go buy paint or OEM spray paint. I might just buy regular red. We'll see how it goes when the time comes. But other than that... There's some stuff that I didn't record just because I'd be busy, you know, and in the zone. In the zone, out of zone. Check this out. But, um, this thing now has three pedals. They're actually not even hooked up. For the life of me, I thought it was like E34s. And I was trying to take off the steering column. <laughs> and to take the steering column off, you there's some damn Jesus bolts. I don't know if you guys see it. Those bolts right there, they're like sheer off bolts. So they're not made to come off. And your boy was right here for at least an hour trying to take this column out. And then hopped on the forums and turns out you don't even need to remove the column, you just put the pedals in. So, pedals are finally in there. Okay, so now, plan, head to David's, pick up the clutch setup, and then come back and... Be my meat. I gotta fix the suspension. That must mean we're at... David's! <laughs> Drifting. I gotta fix it first. Check the, oh, broken coil over here. Yeah. You give me present, I give you present. What? You give me present, I give you present. Yeah. Ready? Oh yeah. <laughs> it's 5,000 miles on here. <laughs> okay, see you guys back at the house. Okay, we're still at David's. Not back, don't see you back at the house. I gotta show you this. Well, we have to show you this. Damn, this thing is literally in there. Yeah. I like how you said I have to help you with the hood and I didn't even help. <laughs> <laughs> Sheesh. Now this is a build, bro. Oh, these are ref shift motor mounts? Yeah. Damn, dude. And what size turbo again? It's a GTX 3576. Oh, 35. I know that number, 35. 35, I just know that that's perfect, kind of. 
Yeah, right? so this is the smallest 35 you can buy because I don't like the 3582. Gotcha. The, spo the boost comes in way too late. It comes in at like 4,500, 4,800. I don't like that. Too, response, too low. Bro. Yeah, so this is going to come earlier, right? Like 3,500, 4,000, my estimate is where the boost is going to kick in. We've got to turn it down though so we don't shoot the rods at the block. <laughs> <laughs> this is going to be a quick ass car, man. Soon this car is going to be up and running. You're gonna do the pipes. Yes. Uh, oh yeah. I'm doing the fabrication. On well, not the fabrication, but I'm doing the ma uh, the intercooler piping, and it should be pretty sick because I was just talking to my buddy how I actually want to weld some more. All right, guys. On so today's episode, we're gonna do the first review on the iPhone 12. So far, Pro. it's Square Edge. Huh? Pro. Pro 12 Pro? Holy shit! <laughs> <laughs> my bad. Flex. <laughs> so far, it's uh really rigid. You know, I kind of like the sleek design, but yeah, this is sick. All right, well, he has to sign up, so we can't really do nothing. Wait, 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 I have, I have, you know, I have a reason to, like, replace my phone, too. Yeah, like... that one's old. <laughs> this one is the 11. We're actually making a whole <laughs> phone review now. Yeah, this one's 11. And it's, I like the ergonomics, you know, aerodynamic seat. But this one, they went older. Yeah, people like actually, but people like that, though. I don't know, I'll find out. Good shit, dude iPhone 12 Pro, the first review. Alright, <laughs> let's go back. I'm gonna put that in the title too. 